Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to play Legend of Mashroom on PC. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So you might be wondering, how do you play Legends of Mushroom on your PC? Because we all know Legends of Mushroom is actually a mobile app. Now, what we need to do is we need to actually access a uh, application that actually can handle Legends of Mushroom. In this case, that's going to be BlueStacks. Now, I would recommend you to visit their official website, which is BlueStacks.com, and click on the option that says Download BlueStacks 10. Now, it should give you the option or you should see the downloaded.exe file. So you could go ahead and just basically uh, click on .exe file and install the app itself on your PC. As you can see, this is going to be .exe file. Now, just follow the steps that you'll be seeing on your screen to successfully install that. But in this case, as you can see on my PC, I've already installed that and we are now ready to install Legends of Mushroom here. In this case, you could go ahead and click on the BlueStacks 5 option here. They'll go ahead and double click on it and it should open up the BlueStacks app player here. Now, in this case, what we need to do next is we need to install the Legend of Mushroom on PC. Now, in this case, just click on System Apps here. You could go ahead and go to Play Store here and log in into your Google account that you have Legend of Mushroom uh, installed or have. Now, in this case, let's go ahead and click on Search Apps and Games. Just type in Legends of Mushroom. And from here, let's go ahead and search for it. And what we need to do next is we need to actually uh, download uh, it into our account. Now, once you've downloaded it, you could go ahead and start playing it on your PC here. But in this case, sometimes the uh, game itself might not be available to you if your region is not correctly set. Now, in this case, make sure that you're using the email or the Google account that you have on your account for you to install it on your PC. But in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.